I didn't have tears today until the doors opened and the dramatic entrance happened and Mackenzie and I were walking down and I saw the lovely people who were here to celebrate them and uh, tears just started coming. Then I noticed Ryan had more tears than me, which was awesome. As my dad pointed out in the second row, he's like, hey, look, Ryan's really crying a lot up there. I said, That's great. Well, guys, it's finally here. It's been a long wait, but the wait's over. You are actually right in the middle of your wedding day. Did you realize you were in the 98th percentile? I actually looked it up, consulted a reliable source, the internet, and found out only 2% of couples who date in high school go on to get married. Those are very, very low numbers. When you think about it, you guys really beat the odds. I'd love to say that I remember the first time I met Ryan Clark, but in all honesty, I don't. <laughs> Ryan Clark has been a part of our family dynamic for so long that I don't remember what our family dynamic was like before him, and I don't foresee much of it changing after this wedding. He makes competitive moves during game night, he's the first one up to get seconds at our family meals, he lets the dogs out without being asked when he comes over, and he trash talks worse than anybody in our family when it comes to card games. He fits into our family just like he's been here our whole entire lives and I have no doubt that he'll be an excellent husband to Mackenzie. I love Ryan, I love my sister, and I couldn't be happier for the two of them together. Ryan Charles Clark, today is our wedding day, and wow, does that instantly bring on so many emotions for me. Today is the day that we get to promise to spend the rest of our lives together, loving each other in front of God, our family, and friends. Hi! Hi. <laughs> Hi! Are you surprised? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Were you wrong when you were trying to predict what it was? <laughs> I, was I was very wrong. <laughs> I was very wrong. Dear Mackenzie, I cannot believe that this day has finally arrived. There's a part of me that feels like this day has come so quickly, and another part of me that is grateful for the road we had to travel to get to this point. In this moment of reflection, I can't help but feel an extreme amount of appreciation for you being a part of my life. It's crazy to think that we met at 14, started dating at 18, and now here we are at the altar at 24. I have dreamt of this day since I was a little girl, and let me tell you, you have far exceeded my wildest dreams. I can't help but to become emotional when I think about us and how far we have come. I didn't know that in high school I would meet my husband, but how lucky am I that that was the plan for us. I know going into this that marriage will not be easy, but I want you to know that I love you. And from this day forward, I choose you over everybody else. I have prayed for my future husband throughout my life many times. You are so, so many answered prayers. I thank God for giving me a life partner who is truly a rock in my weak moments. I want you to know that I will love you like no one else can, and I will cherish you like no one else will. I love you, Mackenzie, and I promise you that will never change. We're enough, you're my person, and I cannot wait to marry you today. I love you more, Mackenzie. What God has joined together, let no person separate. Brian? summer before our senior year, 
had the privilege of spending almost every day with Clark. We frequently talked about life and what his next steps were after graduation. He mentioned plans of marrying Mackenzie and buying a house in Carmel. Well, I asked him what size inflatable pool we should get for the front of our senior college house. <laughs> I began to realize how much I actually looked up to Clark. The man that truly made me a better person the more time I spent. Mackenzie, you are a prime example of what it means to be stunning on the inside and out. You are honestly the most beautiful bride I have ever seen, and I am so honored to be a part of your